A lot happens in a year. This is my favorite way to remember it. This is one year's worth of photos from 2013. The Oklahoma High School State Wrestling Tournament and the MacArthur High School Wrestling Team, coached by Ellis Holt, Bobby Cook, and Mike Miller, some of the hardest working men I know. The Irish Festival at Fair Park, a place where the music always makes me feel like I'm at home. I teamed up with Lon Rickert and the folks at Soup Mobile. We took the homeless to a hockey game and fed them hot dogs and sodas. I went to Paradise out in Oceanside, California to visit my brother Erwin for his birthday and St. Patrick's Day weekend. It's always amazing all the good people Erwin surrounds himself with. Happy birthday, brother. Jason Elmore and the Hoodoo Witch CD release party at the 166 Theater in Carrollton. He always brings the fire. They sing and play as if any day could be their last. Justin Fundays in Justin, Texas. Kinzer comes out to Dallas. I think she was smiling from all the warm weather and outdoor pools. My dear friends Ryan and Jesse and their daughter Bailey. Kaido Man. I traveled out far east Texas to the Hendrix estate. So glad I did not find a scorpion in my bed. A Vegas trip to see the folks with my sister Megan and her beautiful girls. Michaela was so excited about the penny she found. It had to be on the pictures at the pool. A little apples to apples and pictures with the family. Rucker family shoot for Call McCray Rucker. Christina Cruz and her volleyball team. Pat Boyack and those pesky javelins at the GOAT. The Oklahoma City Victory Dolls roller derby team, my first taste of derby action. The Hughes ladies, the family of my dear departed brother, Bobby Hughes. Midnight volleyball event at the Smith House in Lawton, Oklahoma. All day drinking and all night volleyball. And maybe a little bit of wrestling in between. My trip to Ghana, Africa for a trip to help homeless women escape the streets, find a home, and an education. The church service was amazing. They are so passionate about their faith. drive to Cocoa Beach to find the poster child for our campaign. Within an hour, we had found her and her family. We took to downtown Accra to visit the women living on the streets in the unbearable heat. We found the new home of the Pearl House, a nine-bedroom house filled with hope of a new start. To thank the entire Maranatha staff, we took them to a five-star resort for dinner. Then afterwards, we washed their feet as a token of our thanks. Here they are again, the only people crazy enough to make me a godfather. Hayes and his band rocking the night at Top Golf in Dallas, Texas. 
My brother Jason and his wife Julie decided to throw a petting zoo birthday party for their sweet daughter Zoe. I traveled to Chicago to visit my family and surprise my uncle by taking him to the Budweiser Blues Festival in Peoria, Illinois. It was the first time I got to meet Logan. It was my cousin Peter's birthday, so we went and took some photos at the park and went to dinner with his family. Another night of rocking music with Jason Elmore and the Hoodoo Witch at the Goat. We were goating it up that night. This is the Vinyl Thoughts toy show run by my friend Shelby Miller. It is set in a cool old room in Deep Ellum, in an old part of the city just outside of downtown Dallas. A family shoot with the Kings at the Botanical Gardens in Fort Worth, Texas. The Elmore Wedding. Two people who could not have been more perfect for each other. It was a perfect day and a tough morning after. saddest days of my life as we buried my brother and finally gave him peace. Peter and I went to shoot some straw and cornfields in the snow of Montgomery, Minnesota. I was invited to the Dallas Hoedown at Fair Park by Jim Sikora and his band, The Little Blue Pills. Good food, good drinks, good music. My first shoot with Ruby's Revenge as they practice for the start of a new roller derby season for the Assassination City Roller Derby League. I spent Thanksgiving at a palace with my friend Jeff. We then shot a bunch of photos to send to our friends in Ghana. I spent Christmas Day with one of my second families, the Merchants. I have known this family since I was in seventh grade when they lived down the street from me in Lawton, Oklahoma. They have never stopped caring for over 20 years. Fast Cuss decided to do a Christmas video, so I snuck in a few photos on the side. These are some of the awesome people I work with. This was my first shoot with a professional model. I was pretty nervous, and she was pretty amazing. This was my first experience at Whirly Ball with my brothers Daniel and Steven. We then returned to his apartment for some drinking and driving at Mario Kart and a new drinking game called Chug. Thanks to all who shared in the memories I hold so dear, another great year.